My name is Peyton Short, and I chose to talk about how pests affect biodiversity, specifically bark beetles in Colorado. Bark beetles have caused a major amount of damage to the forests in Colorado. There have been 41.7 million acres of damage as of 2019. The main trees that are impacted are the spruce, lodgepole, pinyon juniper, and ponderosa trees. Spruce being the most affected due to how the spruce beetles are the most prevalent in this area. Bark beetles from the U are from the U.S. and have 600 different types of species. They get the name bark beetle from how they burrow under a tree's bark to reproduce. In Colorado, the two main types of beetles that are a major concern are the spruce beetles and the mountain pine beetles. The negative impacts of these beetles span across the Rocky Mountains of the West Coast. These include quite a few mountain ranges in Colorado like the Rocky Mountain National Park, San Juan Mountain Range, West Elk Mountain Range, and the Sawatch Mountain Range. In these locations, the beetles are contributing to most of the forest damage along with the wildfires in this state. Due to dry conditions already present in this state, wildfires are a huge risk already. The risk becomes greater when many of the trees in the area are already dead and dried out. This leads to the destruction of habitats, wildlife, food supplies, and human civilization. The atmosphere has also played a huge impact on how prevalent the beetles are. With climate change, Colorado has been more hot and dry than ever before, which so, just so happens to be the very conditions that bark beetles thrive in. This allows for beetles to come out earlier in the year and have longer periods of time where they can actively attack the trees. These conditions also leave trees defenseless due to how they use water as a defense against these beetles. The Western Park Beetle Research Group was formed as a way to help find a solution to the problems caused by these beetles. They work to get more information faster and provide it to other researchers. Forest services are also learning as much as they can about the beetles to better understand and take action against them. It is also advised that the people living in Colorado don't leave their firewood stacked outside where the beetles have easy access to it.